Hi boys and girls, it's time for our story. Today we're going to read the book called When Spring Comes. In the month of March, which today is the very last day of March, we celebrate spring. And this book talks about the different signs of spring. Okay, do we get oh there we go before spring comes the trees look like black sticks against the sky do we see the cardinals on the trees how many cardinals do we see that's right one two but if you wait spring will bring leaves and blossoms there goes the cardinal flying away. If you wait, spring will make the leftover mounds of snow smaller and smaller and smaller until suddenly they're gone. I think all the snow's gone for now, don't you? Before spring comes, the grass is brown. But if you wait, spring will turn it green and add little flowers. Do you have flowers yet in your backyard? Some of us do. They're starting to come out. If you wait, an egg will become a bird. A seed will start growing. Look at this egg, boys and girls. That looks like it might be a robin's egg. And look, this little seed is a flower. Spring comes with sun. Spring comes with rain, and more rain, and more rain. We had a lot of rain this weekend, didn't we? But we need it for our green grass. Do you like mud? Do you like puddles? I hope you like umbrellas. Before spring comes, the garden is just dirt and empty. But if you wait, spring will push green shoots throughout the dirt to fill up the garden. Uh-oh, the bunny's eating the garden. Better get the bunny out. He's not supposed to be in there. And spring will call out the pussy willows and new kittens too. Spring can come quickly or slowly. It changes its mind a lot. But when spring is finally here to stay, you will know it. There will be buds and bees and boots and bubbles. Doesn't that look like fun? I like to play outside and blow bubbles, do you? There will be worms and wings and wheels. You will feel it, you will smell it, you will hear it. When spring is finally here to stay, you might think you are done waiting, but you are not. What do you think? 
think you're going to be waiting for if you're not waiting for spring anymore? What comes next? <gasps> That's right. Now you have to wait for summer. So boys and girls, do you have spring happening in your yard right now? I went and looked in my backyard to see if I could see some signs of spring. And I took some pictures. So I'm gonna show you a few pictures at the end of my little video to show you some of the signs of spring that I found. So maybe later today, you can go and play in your backyard and see if you have signs of spring too. Bye. Crocuses, some of the first flowers of spring. Daffodils, getting ready to bloom. A bird's nest, waiting for eggs to be laid. New buds on a branch.